Hello, 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 I hope you didn't think that your sloppy hacking was uncredible. Because that would be pretty sad. I see you filled out my extendable username slash nickname form. God, you must have been del deliciously interested in me to do that. Me a, you sent me a virus. I literally could not exit out the screen. Come, come on. We both know that you could have got out of the screen if you wanted to. Don't act like you didn't just hack through all my firewall. Giving you a made-up username is just easy than doing all the work. I just think it's interesting that this is the choice you made out of the two. Getting to me, getting to know me rather than getting to know my skills. But I'll act like I believe in your boss excuse this time. Anyways, I've been talking crap about about you later, but I want to do it right. What are your pronouns? She slash her. Aren't you being a little unfair? I don't know your pronouns. Alright, Angel. I'll play fair. The name's Machel Eugene. He slash him. Nice to meet you. Yeah, can I also get your credit card number with the three whack numbers on the back as well? Otherwise, these details are useless to me. Curious about me, aren't you? 
cares about me, aren't you? No. Well, I left the bag oh, quite bottom right up there. I just want it to be a bounty clear. You're talking to me because you want to talk to me. And I wouldn't want it any other way. Mm, my interest might be a little piggy by you, but you're definitely obsessed with me. Oh, am I now? Oh, you aren't? So, don't want me here? I guess that's my cue to leave. Wait! I wouldn't say I'm obsessed, but I would say that I'm not interested in you. Yeah, tell me more. You injured foot me. Oh, yeah? Yes. How so? You know, I never had a guy beg to get to know me after hacking him. You're kind of weird, aren't you? I've never had someone hack me just to leave me a dumb message. But you liked it! And you're liking the fact that I liked it. Touchy. You found me from the CTF tournament, right? CTF? Question mark. The cup in the flag hacking tournament, where you got second and I took first. Not surprised, a sore loser hacked me because of that. Says the person who has to prove themselves hacking me back. You only got into my system because I had an off day. Oh really now, maybe you can prove it to me with a rematch. I never said no to rematches. You ready to uplift it? Sorry, who's the loser again? That wasn't even fair, I only had one chance. That's because the prize was extremely valuable. I didn't even know that there was a prize. That's because it was a pro surprise. So, what was it? Let me, let me let you guess. It's valuable. Money. It's more precious than that. Time. Think bigger. Being away from you. Quite the opposite. It was me, you could have had my hand in marriage. Da da da. This is the first time and probably the only time I'm going to say this. I'm glad I lost. Whoa! What made you think that was a good prize? My ego. Yeah, okay, that makes a lot of sense. So, why are you going through such lens to match me? You pig it. my interest with, with your little bit message. Well, doing my line now, you're not the gentleman I expect you to be. Little message, please don't, don't play so much. You guys have to Are you stealing my line now? You're not the gentleman I expect you to be. Never said I was nice. Good, I'm not into nice guys. Cat got your tongue? I can perfectly hear you blushing from here. You're evil. I see. You're not into nice girls either, are you?
kitchen. Sir, am I coming on too strong? Didn't you know that would be possible given the fact that you're hacking me and everything. Oh. You're right, you win this round. And I'll be winning the rest of it as well. Now, I don't know about that one. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Is that so? That is so. Hmm. Mm. You're stupid. Anyways. That's so cute. Did you draw that? As a fact of... As a matter of fact, I did. Is that your cat? Yeah, her name is... Scrooge. Scrooge is so cute. She's the only reason your art looks so nice. Her stripping kind of reminds me of a skunk. I'm glad you agree. Yeah, I love her stripes. I dyed my hair to match her. Copycat much? I cannot deny that she is the blueprint. I can never see her now. She's so cute. I might believe that to dye my hair right. Well, you got a strip of wood down your head too. I don't think you could pull it off like she does. You be surprised. You wish you were as cute as her. Why don't you be the judge of that? Hmm? Let me video call. Oh no, he is hot. I'm sorry, what did you say? I couldn't quite catch that. Oh no, his voice is hot too. <laughs> you really don't have a filter, do you? It's cute. So, am I as cute as my cat? Uh, no, I think I'm cutting off. I think my PC, I think it has a bug. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't hear that. Oh, I think I did. Uh, I think I've got to go. Don't run away. I, uh, I, uh, I'm cutting out. Please, we both know you got the most expensive Wi-Fi there is. Oops, you caught me red-handed. Oh, sorry. I freaking hate you. Anyways, do you like food? You're really good at making conversation, Angel. Shut up. How is this conversation gonna move? We freaking just met and it's a getting to know you type of question. It, it is it not. I don't know what's cuter. That there's a million conversation starters you could choose from, and you choose to ask what my favorite food is? Or the fact that you wanted to get to know me? Oh, so you think you can be better than me? From just that one question? I think I can, actually. I raise you this question. Do you enjoy food? You suck. <laughs> Okay, okay, seriously, seriously. What's your favorite food? Burgers. Wait, that's my favorite food too. Hey, you stole that from me. Burgers are universe's favorite. How could I steal that from you? Just because. Where are your sources? 
My source? It's from micahugen.org. Did you not know that? Need me to cite it in MLA format for you, Angel? Can you even spell your own name? Yup. M-I-C-A-H... U... Wait. Wait, that, that doesn't count. I'm pretty sure it does. Um, you stole my favorite food! <laughs> and you manipulated me to spell my name wrong! Fine, if you want to play that game, I will steal your favorite food then. But that's my- Nope, pick another one. What's your favorite food? You... You what? You didn't let me finish. What were you thinking of? Just continue. You, me, in a gas station. It's 3 a.m. What are we doing? What are you doing? We're getting food. But, there's zombies. Uh-huh. You're the shark shooter. Sharp shooter? You're the badass. God, we can both agree that I'm the... chip. I'm grabbing the food. Because you're useless? But I suck at grabbing food. Not surprised. And what else do I suck at? Opening doors. We're so dead. We get locked up in a bathroom stall. What happens? What happens? I get hungry. You only grabbed useless things, didn't you? I only grabbed plastic wrappers. Who would have guessed? You're nice. Gracious, even. Looks like you're only good at stationing the obvious. You offer your arm up so that I can eat it. Well, okay. I say yes. I'm a scumbag. Yep, you are. Your arm is the best thing I've ever tasted. Yum. Good to know that if there were ever was a zombie apocalypse, you would not be my partner. Hey, I would be a great asset to our team. If great asset means dead weight, then sure. <laughs> okay, we'll see about that if the time comes. You'll be begging for me to be on your team. Yes, I will love Captain Sharp sh Sharpshooter on my team. Exactly! You're getting the point, Angel. So, now that I know what your favorite food is, what's your favorite color? What is this, a first date? Yeah, this is actually a speed dating event, hosted by yours truly, and you're the first on the roster. Ha, I'm also probably the one on, one on it too. Whoa, 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 you're moving things pretty quickly. What do you mean? I mean, immediately claiming the number one spot? Just say you want to marry me already, Angel. Would it be too much to say that I'd rather die? Well, you sure are taking until death do us part a little too seriously. Just so you know, I'm not counting this as my first date. Why is that? Wait, I know why. Afraid it'll be too breathtaking? After this date, you'd be so devastated. Nothing could ever be able to compare to... The Micah Eugen Experience! <laughs> ka -chink. Here's your ticket, Angel. I didn't know you were a clown. Um, actually, this isn't a clown song. It's called Entry of the Gladiators for a reason. So stand behind me, Angel, and enjoy the show. I'll gladly sacrifice myself to protect you. Sacrifice yourself, is that a bit much? It's never too much to protect my fellow comrades! Comrades, I wouldn't classify us, uh, us as... Come at me! Don't worry, Angel, I got the... Uh, a sword went right through me! I'm done for. Ah, no! I... Do you just fall out of your chair for a bit? 
Yeah, I did. Did you laugh? Yup, I did. Actually, no. Stop! You don't need to reply! I already know you did. You're so full of yourself. Am I now? Or am I just confident? Whether you want to call that... That's not the reason why I'm not concerned. This is as my first date. Oh, really? What's the reason, then? I already manipulated plans my first date. Oh? It's called window resistance. First, my date will claim through my window. Then... Uh, uh, hold it right there, Angel. What, what did you just say? Sorry, do you need new speakers or something? I want something to climb through my window. Uh, like some stalker? What? That's so rude. Is it though? It is it? It's like sneaking your high school boyfriend through your window. It's romantic. On a first date? No, that's definitely some stalker shit. It's like the next door neighbor trope. I don't think that even classifies as a first date. The fact that you're no getting this is driving me insane. Please explain it to me then, Angel. Okay, so first date. It's not necessary. The first date, the first time we met. It's the first time we're getting to know each other more romantically. Mm-hmm. So it's somewhat intimate and personal like a date where we're cuddling up in a blanket watching a dumb and cheesy romance movie just simple and enjoying each other's company for someone with a very strong opening of wanting your date to climb through your window that's actually very cute i know it's cute you just need to, to let me finish i don't want to burst your bubble but opening up with such a banger like I want someone to climb through my window will make any person's jaw drop. In a good way. Mmm, debatable. But, note taken. What are you even taking notes for? Mm, just studying my rival. Hey, that's my alarm for work and I haven't eaten yet, so I'm going to get some food. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, yeah, run away. I'll be looking forward to our rematch. And I'll be looking forward to seeing the look on your face when you lose. <laughs> Don't get ahead of yourself now. Please, I've caught your attention to this existence and you will you still want to play coy. Me? Playing coy? Oh, I would never. Sure. <laughs> well, this little piece of shit got you a present. It should arrive at your door soon. Gosh, you're a stalker. <laughs> you act like finding your address wasn't child's play. I'm sure you'll love what I got you. I really doubt it. Let's bet on it. Message me back when you get it. You know, I'm definitely going to skew the bet in my favorite right. I've already calculated that factor in. If you don't like it enough to lose a bet with me, then it's not a very good present, is it? Whatever, you're so cheeky, I have to go now. Okay, bye! Serious about the fear. You move quickly from your bedroom to your living room, opening the front door slowly. Your eyes throw down your doorstep and they stop at the food delivery bag that sits lonesome on the pavement. You pick it up, even it curves you before spotting a note tape onto the opening. Not so stupid now, am I? Still stupid, but on a serious note, thank you for the food. 
Uh, agree, disagree, but you're welcome. All right, Mister. I can't spell my own name. Mitchy, you can. Did you cheat? I did not. You, you, favorite food stiller. Like I said, I didn't. Mmm, sure you didn't. Where is your evidence? I'm gonna need you to cite that dummy. That evidence is your, of your orgy. That's, that's not a real website. I just search it up. Tis tuts, you can't use fake citizen on me. Up your butt, Eugene. You're evil. Evil what? Can you not think of a noun? You're evil. Oh, so you can't think of me? Move one. You finally opened the back, already taking the run. That you probably know all too well. The sound from this burger alone was one you could never forget. Some people could say you were a runner, but if anyone else saw this burger, they definitely think the same. The way the patty glimmered in between the loads, the plump buns, vegetable with cheese and drip to the bottom bun. You were in fact in utopia. You eat your food glowing like a stupid idiot because you're happy he remembered. He regretfully that he can't see you now because you'd rather die than let him see the robot that he gave you. You shouldn't be happy just for this. You shouldn't yet and yet. The butterflies rush through your body every time you take a bite and you know you should stop slimy. You should stop the little butterflies through you and through butter and flounder because, well, they're going to give you a stomach pain later. But you didn't. No, you can't. You think of his stupid Chucky and his stupid words, his stupid face. His stupid smile, his stupid glowing, glowing eyes. You think that you should stop thinking now, but you already know you're too far gone. His story is already the only thought in your head. You knew you had work for the rest of the day, but your grand couldn't hide the fact that you were already looking forward for your next conversation. So the bug, you win this time, cousin. Kind of.